from the enemy. You're not a Nazi, Jojo. You're a ten-year-old kid who likes dressing up in a funny uniform and wants to be part of a club. They'll never win. Loki? Loki! Oh, God. Well, here's why you should go and see this movie. It's because it'll change your life. Um, here's how I know that uh, cinema is, uh, is good, is when people leave and they, uh, they can't talk. So this film, with some people, uh, has the ability to shut them up. And they go and they sit in a quiet corner and they think about life and they think about the message of the film, which is to encourage people to think for themselves and to not follow the pack, especially in times of intolerance and hate. Why so happy? Things are changing. The Allies have taken Italy, France would be next, and soon the war would be over. God damn it! Why does that make you happy? You hate your country that much? I love my country. It's a war I hate. It's pointless and stupid. And the sooner we have peace, the better. Oh, the war will end. We will crush our enemies into dust. And when they are destroyed, we shall use their graves as toilets. OK, no more politics. Dinner is neutral ground. This table is Switzerland. Well, I think this film actually might be a drama with a lot of jokes in it. But, um, you know, there's a lot of heartfelt stuff in this film. So, um, you know, it's... Yes, it's got humour in it, but um, it's a lot more than that. And the secret, really, for me, is just trying to find the, the tonal balance between all of those different parts of the film. You know, it's trying, trying to find those really heartfelt, very tragic moments in the film, and then making them work with the, uh, the more ridiculous moments. Today, you boys will be involved in such activities as war games, <laughs> ambush techniques, and blowing stuff up. I don't think I can do this. Boss, of course you can. That's what I think life is like. It's a mixture of ridiculous and, and, uh, and tragic. It's time to burn some books! Yeah!